Um, all right, that's great. Joshua, give us a quick music rec before you leave, brother. Yeah, so this week I want to share um, this great classic. Unless you, I should just say, unless yeah. you want to hang out and do one additional story with us after the record pick, you sure. let me know. Okay, yeah. go ahead. Cool. So this week I want to talk about um, Nina Simone and um, this record, Revolution, which this is one of the, this, it's like an old original 45 um, from, it's this, uh, RCA had the Super Soul R&B series that this came out on, and it was put out in um, March in 1969. And um, for a song about revolution, um, it's very calming and uplifting, um, as well as, you know, like her voice I just find to be just so gentle and fierce in its complexity um, and its depth. Like it's literally a deep voice and it's, um, I don't know, it soothes me in a way. And I picked it because you know, during these uprisings right now, a lot of people are looking to 1968-69 as a reference for context. And normally for this uh, series, I go for music outside of that period, um, just because it's kind of saturated. I tend to go for, you know, music from other countries or other moments. Um, but I wanted to celebrate her um, just for a moment and the body of work that was the product of those struggles. Um, and the you know, one of the things that I love about Nina Simone is she had a very self-aware sense of her role as a singer uh, in a social movement ecology. So she located her role as a cultural worker in, in relationship to organizers, in relationship to organization, in relationship to building infrastructure. And as opposed to, for example, like a politicized musician that's just right. responding to the general tone of the times, that she was a part of the social movement and this was her role, was to create culture as, as a member of, of a social movement. And, um, you know, she would say things like, you know, in her reflections, like, I was needed, I needed to sing to help my people. Um, one of my favorite Nina Simone quotes is, um, I, make song, or, I make songs to make people curious about themselves which I just love that notion of curiosity about oneself being an engine for liberation of, of a way that people can access their sense of dignity to say like, Hey, I do deserve this. Um, and uh, that engine of curiosity, I just find flows through her whole catalog. And another reason why I was drawn to her is she was a contemporary of a lot of our movement elders who are still alive today, who are part of those movements. And, you know, I've shared a little bit on the show before of being mentored by some of those people. I feel very aware of the scars of that generation, um, the level of sacrifice, the havoc that being a part of those movements wreaked on their personal lives, on their marriages. And, you know, Nina's story is, is uh, also a heartbreaking one. You know, her, her career was destroyed out of a commitment to the movement. Um, she navigated bipolar disorder uh, in a movement space that couldn't, you know, didn't have the complexity of care to necessarily hold her in that, especially in the pressures of the backlash uh, after that, you know, revolutionary period um, came to a head. And if you want to hear more about that, I really recommend the documentary, um, What Happened, Ms. Simone, is a really good one. And... Um, the level of movement trauma from that era is still really palpable and it's also guideposts about how we can navigate with more kindness than uh, that generation had. Um, and um, so I take that as a lesson and also that in the kind of pressure cooker of that experience, it gave birth to some of the most beautiful uh, creativity um, and birth people like Nina Simone, who's you know, one of the greatest songwriters, I think, in the history of mankind, uh, but, um, you know, certainly in this country. So do check out that song. If you want to, if you look on YouTube, there's actually a live recording of her playing the song Revolution that's quite beautiful. Um, but obviously, uh, check out her whole catalog. Awesome. You just watched a Michael Brooks show video. Subscribe to get them all. Why wouldn't you? Don't be foolish. Click subscribe below and become a patron as well. Patreon.com slash TMBS. Thanks, everybody.